Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 16 of the Adobe InDesign tutorial series and today we're going to look at how to insert special characters inside of InDesign. So to insert special character what you can do is you can go to type over here and you can see special characters. So normally what well, we don't remember how to type the characters we need. So you can go to type and then go to insert special character and inside of a special character you can see that you can find uh, bullets right there that you can use in list format you can also use something like a copyright symbol and you can use something like let's say uh, go to special uh, character right here and you can see section symbol and so forth so you can see all of these symbols uh, can actually be uh, written down over here that's a, that's a much more easier way as well. If you're familiar with Microsoft Word, it's kind of similar to that. Uh, so what you can simply do is you can go to type and go to glyphs uh, panel right here. In the glyphs panel, you can see that there are a lot of symbols that you can use uh, that, uh, that, may be, uh, uh, that may be of common use. So what you can do is you can actually scroll down. As you can see, uh, you see that there are a lot of fonts right here. So simply uh, select the font that you want and then uh, double click it so go over here and you can see you can uh, go up or down just like this you can increase the size of the clip panel just like this and then over here you can see that there are a lot of fonts that you can use just like that so you there are a lot of fonts just like that as you can see so you can go uh, to the top right here all right so let me just go and drag it up to the top you have to click and drag so and double click and you can see that that get the dollar sign gets inserted right there uh, you can also show uh, parts of the font so there's entire font over here the punctuation if you choose punctuation only that uh, signal symbols are being displayed right here uh, if you want to say standard um, legislatures you can see that there's only these files that is being the, uh, these fonts that is being displayed and over here in this section let's say uh, you want the, the superscript only the super uh, superscript font is being displayed Greek only the Greek uh, gets displayed and so forth so you can see that there are a lot of uh, things that you can uh, select for example uh, I want to go to lining figures you just get the lining figures just like that and you can see that uh, instead of having to type it on regular basis you can simply select it here and once you do that you can also see that uh, they get collected onto this recently used section so if you want to use them again you can simply uh, double click and it'll get placed on where the cursor is being placed down if you want to choose a different font you can simply select the font that you want from over here from this section over here let me select the dubai font and you can see that you have that font just like that and you can select all of the form all of the symbols that you want to add in and they gets added to the recently used section so this is how you insert special characters inside of indesign hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe